so far there is no sign of any Iraqi fighters in Kobani and ISIS militants continued to fire mortar rounds in heavy fighting overnight. There were six more US-led airstrikes yesterday around Kobani, which lies in a key strategic position on Syria's border with Turkey. ISIS uses that border to smuggle weapons and fighters into the war zone. And there have been more than 130 US-led airstrikes in and around Kobani over the last two weeks killing hundreds of ISIS fighters in the most intense barrage since the air campaign began. Now, the U.S. Central Command says that the primary focus of the airstrikes against ISIS is restoring security here in Iraq. But in Syria, Kobani has become a very public test of whether those airstrikes can actually stop the advance of the Islamic extremists. Three U.S. planes dropped bundles of light arms, ammunition and medical supplies to Kobani on Sunday, a sign of just how desperate things have become for the men and women who are defending the town.